Hello, my lovely Taurus. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Taurus, today we'll do your weekly energies, Sun, Moon, Rising Science, and Venus Science, and this is the third week of January. Let's see, loves, what this week brings to us, what are those energies we need to pay attention, and of course, what are those messages Spirit want to deliver to you. Keep in mind, is a general reading, as always, might resonate with you, might not. Because many, many of you might feel like, well, that's not me, that's the other person. Don't feel that you cannot switch the character and switch the energies. If it's not you, it's the other person. That might be a strong message you need to pay attention. Let's see, loves, how this blessing to you and how this energy flows out there. An overall energy for the Taurus, King of Wands. Taking action towards something or somebody takes action in the situation where you are. Yeah, you might deal here with the fire sign. It's all possible. Knight of Pentacles. You, you are not sure if this connection still works between you two or not. It's like you, you are in relationship with somebody, but you are not. It's like I'm more single than with them. What gotta do now? Something at that extent. There's something here about we might not be at the same page. We might not work things as we want to. Or the things are not really working there. Let's see. Six of Cups. Fool. Ace of Cups. Two of Wands. Tower. Ten of Swords. Something here is shifting, my loves. Devil. Three of Pentacles. And the Temperance. All right. Somebody here is working a lot. It's like they are in relationship with their work, not as much with you. Somebody here is very much focused on their finances, not on the career or not on the relationship. It's like career over everything. And that needs a balance. Because somebody here is thinking, if that will continue, then I believe this is quite over. And somebody here is, yes, there is working, working, working. And somebody here feels like overworked. It's like a burn out. Okay. This is like somebody here is burned out. And that's the relationship. Addicted to work, 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 work. I work, work, work. I indeed see here fire sign. I see Scorpio. Sag as fire. Aries as fire. And the Capricorn energy. And yes, we are in the Capricorn season still, loves. There is something here needs to change. And somebody here feels like, well, wherever I am, I know I need to have a change. I know I need to have some sort of balance. There is no balance in somebody's life. And that might be you, that might be the person you are dealing here. Because two of pentacles, somebody is thinking that whatever things are right now doesn't work. I need something here more easy because affects with who I am, where I am, and many, many things. Somebody here might, might not have a vacation for over three years. There's a long time somebody here didn't really have, you know, a break. And somebody feels like, well, I need a break or I need something new. But the tower is right in the middle because right now this is happening. 
the timeline is right now. Okay. Let's see here. What's the tower for here? Emperor. Somebody here is a boss or something here, like, you know, the head of something. And there's a lot of responsibilities here. There's a high end job could be but it's kind of like there's so much consuming time hermit virgo energy and now feels like do i need this or do i do not star is this what i want or not and i feel here that might be you taurus that might be you look at here with with the tower clarifying three major arcanas Emperor, Hermit, and the Star, and the Hierophant, that something else loves. And I feel here is like, now I need to reflect, do I really want this? Do I really need this? Or not? Because is that energy is like, it's not that you cannot do this. It's not that you cannot do this. But the, the question is, do I want this anymore or not? As you see here, we have Aries, Virgo, and Aquarian energy here. It's like deep thinking. And it's like, with the Aquarius energy, is like healing. With the Aries energy, is like, go get it go move it with the Virgo energy is like wait a little bit do I need this because it's like it seems here that you are all alone in this or you you think is this what is a stable energy for me or not and indeed here we do have two healing cards here And indeed here I'm talking with a with a Taurus who who have a high position and as well high requirements is like controlling things, making things right. It's a position you you worked hard for. But now you're feeling like, do I need this anymore? Because it's, it's consuming time. It's impacting my marriage or my commitments. So that's the thing here. Because something here doesn't really go the way it is. And somebody here might tell you the things... Ten of Swords. Page of Pentacles, Six of Wands, Page of Swords, and Justice, Libra Energy here. But it's something here is like, look for something new, which you can go through very well. And there's a lesson to learn. Even somebody here feels like if I will downgrade how I will feel, you'll feel way better. Somebody here, indeed, it's it's burnout. Try to, to make things work, being very organized. But now that, that might change. Because something here is not working as you used to. It's like I'm I'm constantly doing what I do and now analyzing the things. Do I really want this? And something here is like I want to learn something else. I want to do something else, which will give me some sort of balance. 
because whatever is here time consuming energy consuming what's the devil for here five of swords Knight of Pentacles and Two of Cups. Underneath we have King of Cups. The energy here very much speaks that the environment you are changed a lot. Okay? And might not be a genuine environment as you used to because what I'm feeling here there is a lot on your shoulders loves and there's not much satisfaction it's like somebody here might feel well I get the money indeed but being satisfied I don't feel so or with whoever I'm working I feel they they are not really into the same as I am because I do more than they do and then I get the same pay so now is the thing here that I I want to start something new I want to go towards something new which is more easy more joyful more balanced more loving Because whatever I'm doing, whatever I am now, whatever environment I am now, I feel here that changed a lot. And indeed, indeed changed over the time. So I feel here there is like in, in that point, a Taurus got to that, I, I might need a, a big change. And I feel here this change may happen in a very short time with the tower moment. Tower and the fool is at this moment. But I feel here it's like whatever it is, many, many of you Taurus, you are hardworking. You are the ones who put a lot of effort and also you are a fixed sign you need something stable and i feel here now is changing the vision of what is stable for me what makes me stable and that that will be a change it's like a revision a revision of what i had and what I want for the future. Because things got quite hectic and is not only affecting you, but affects those around you as well. So indeed here, there's a Taurus here, quite ready for change or will be in a very short time and i feel here the universe tries to help you to to get through that okay let's see here one outcome for you one outcome out of all this or what are the strong message you need to hear as outcome chariot Go ahead. And underneath we do have the world. So it's kind of for many, many of you loves. It's kind of like, what should I do? To stay where I am? Because I feel here you are thinking of the change. And you feel like the things are not as used to. And you seeking for an answer, yes, no. On these two cards, the answer is yes. If you want to change things, go ahead. 
because there's a new chapter in front of you and the energy changes as we speak right now by the mid-summer 2021 okay indeed my loves so there is something here you you need to wrap it up and go ahead also i see here there is a lot of positive energy i can do this and that is very much for your own balance. And I see you very much patient with the process. Good job, Taurus. All right, loves. That's what I have for you for this week coming up. And of course, we'll see you next time. Namaste.